Get set for a side-splitting experience with the Karens and Kevins. Their playful banter and humorous adventures will keep you entertained. Up first, what this Karen says is absolutely crazy. Listen to the way that you're talking. Listen to well, your I'm voice. Gay. You sound like a female. I I'm gay. And you should go yourself now. Oh. Can I get a pint of Jose wow. Cuervo, please? You are totally getting... Like, all oh, this is you're the one who damn near had a fit because you, you thought I like, budged in front of you. You, you know how many people budge in front of me every day and I don't say nothing? I bet because I don't you're care. pretty trash. Why waste, why waste my, this is why waste my Karen is publicly accusing Sam Smith. You belong in hell. Sam Smith belongs in hell. You demonic, <laughs> twisted, sick bastard. Leave the kids alone, you sick record. Sam Smith is a Rumor. Mr. Rumor. Off the, the kids. You sick mother Sam Smith. You evil. This kid is really scary, but her mother is busy being a Karen. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You been saying you won't punch me in my mouth? No, come come punch me. Girl, you're doing it. Doing it. Karen seem to be skateboard haters. Just look at this Karen. She's exhausted with walking 20 steps, but she wants to create a scene. It's a f***ing kid! Yeah! He's a f***ing kid! Drunk Karen hits the guy's car. She's going nuts. Are you laughing? Are you laughing? Laugh! Come on, laugh! 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 You smashed my car. You smashed my car. You're drunk driving and smashed my car. You smashed my car. Do you have insurance? And up in, yeah, I do. I have what bruises. I'm bleeding. I have everything. How is this going to go? My car is car, <laughs> car is smashed in the middle of the street. So you're drunk sad. driving. You're smashing my car. <laughs> you think you got a good one, huh? No, sir. No, sir. No. Talk to your friend and tell her where she is. Tell her where you are so you can win the And I'm the one that's leaving, right? You seem okay, but you should sit down. I am okay. You should sit. I think you'll feel better if you sit. How come? And you. Why is that funny? Yeah. Oh, I'm aware. I'm just angry. Yeah. Meet a whole Karen family. Roll the clip. Why don't you get the hell off this boy? Casey, 
If you're threatening me, just call, call, the back police. call the police. Call the police. Back up. She's threatening me with video typing. Dude. I'm only video typing, so you guys are good. 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 Why are you doing this? Can Why did they say? Pull? Which the pole? pole's up. That's right here. They did a great job. <laughs> and not only that, be, you don't have anything. And I'll be excited whenever the police come. So, me too. So, I'm just going to keep paying a little bit. Just tell me you ain't going to do anything. You're not going to pay. She is fighting. My, uh, my friends have tried to stop. Let me see. Let me go off. I called the police. The police, the police are, are coming. coming. Get off my land. Them. With them to get off my land. Until they get here. Do not. Let's calm down. She's gonna hit my friend. Oh, I'm not her. No. Yes, I am. Please. She tried. She took her. Yes, I Good stand up right there. Yes. Please. Please. Yes. They can't help themselves causing troubles. Just check this Karen. TikTok you know, took it down. You know, you are dressed like you are very pepper. You very. You you dress very pepper triple right now. I let that man leave, man. You got that man blocked in over there. Look, man, that's crazy. That's crazy. Man, you have more important things to worry about. Like, man, you have more important things to worry about. You have to get you a neck, man. You have to go get you a neck. You have no neck, man. You got to go get you a neck. You out here being racist. You don't even have a neck, man. You got to get you a neck. You hear me? Ma'am, ma'am, I know what they said next. You go on Amazon right now, they got Nicks for $27. You get you a whole Nick. You just put it on your shoulders. Okay. You put it on your shoulders and you good, ma'am. Okay? Come on your car. I'm about to move up. Uh oh, about to get real. Come on your car. I'm about to move up. It's about to get real. It is about to get real. And ma'am, with some shoes like that, this is not what you want. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. They're about to toss it. They're about to toss it. There she go. She caught her fat. She ca I know you ain't going. Uh oh. There they go. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. There you go. That's how you stand up for our brothers and sisters. Man, you gotta go get you a nick now. Go get you a nick. Just go on Amazon, man. Get you a nick. Are you a real? That's what I'm talking about. Look at her. Now she ain't got nothing to do. Ma'am, you just wasted all your time and your life, and you still ain't got no neck. You still ain't got no neck, and you wasted all your time. Now we have this Karen, who disturbs her neighbor and is accusing her child. Get away from my house and close my door. Close my door. And what's your name? None of your business. Okay, but yeah, you come up here bamming on my door, waking me up. Wake my child up, and now you won't leave. Call the police. Call them. Okay. I ain't give a damn. Okay. Stand in film with your little camera. I He's will. He's just as bad as you are. <laughs> Lady, you don't know my child. My child minds his business your child just as I do. like you. How do you know my child when he barely even leaves the house? Who are you, lady? <laughs> Who are you? I would really love to know. Karen employees harass the man by accusing him of stealing. I paid for my stuff in here, this woman harassing my basket, don't want to let my basket go. Look what I'm dealing with. I just paid for all my stuff in here. Tell her I paid. I paid for my stuff. She just harassed me in here, in the store. Call the supervisor. Call the supervisor right now. Call the supervisor right now. Let my basket go. Let my basket go. Let my basket go. You just saw me pay for everything, and I left it with you because I said I'm going to get Splendor, and last time they harassed me in here saying I was stealing. Where's the supervisor? I want the supervisor. This is harassment. Call the supervisor. Go get him now. This is discrimination and harassment. She just saw me purchase all my stuff right there, so she has no reason to be pulling on my basket. Call the supervisor. Okay. Call a supervisor now. I get, I get the money. Oh, you have radio? Yeah. I'm in Walmart. 
I done purchased my item and hit that inject on my basket like I'm stealing. Thank you, sir. This is this is uncalled for. I'm an African American and I feel very discriminated against. I pay for everything I come in this store to get. He's coming right now. This is unfair to me. Please get him. This is very unfair to me. And you can show the receipt. I'm gonna show the receipt and I'm gonna show him the video because I'm call I'm calling corporate. This is gonna be on the news. I'm getting harassed in here for no reason. And you just witnessed me purchase everything. Everything. There's no reason she should be checking on my basket like that. This is the manager right here. I'm gonna speak with him. I just wanna let you know what's going on. First of all, I purchased all of my items right here in this aisle where she's watching and monitoring. After I purchased my items, I let this lady know I need to go back and get Splendor, what is in my basket. I leave my basket with her. Okay. After I purchased my items, got my receipt, go back for the Splendor, come back right here. She sees me again. I get my Splendor, pay for that with my next receipt. When I come to the door, she's jacking all my basket, pulling me back. I feel discriminated against. I'm a black man. Why are you pulling on my basket like that? And all my stuff is purchased. And you just witnessed me buy that. That's unfair to me, brother. Mm -hmm. Put yourself in my shoes. How would you feel? I got you. And we'll deal with that. We'll review the footage. Review the footage. I would like a corporate office number or whoever number I could call. Because this footage will be released. Everything she done just now was recorded. Okay. It was harassment. This is my second time coming in this store and dealing with this type of situation. The last time I came, you had two other ladies, not you, but whoever the supervisor had them working at that door. They harassed me with the same thing. I've never stole nothing out of Walmart. I come in here every day with a pocket full of money. There's no reason I should be getting harassed. Okay, and I'll deal with her on a side note. I appreciate you. Thank you. And I'll be taking this to how you, um, how you leave, man. You have a good Thank day. you. You too. God bless. This Karen is invading her neighbor's house and damaging their belongings. She's weird. If anybody's thirsty, they left a ton of beer around. I mean, that's not, that's, that's not even legal. You can't leave beer where kids can get to it. I knocked on the door. They're not home. I knocked on the door. They're not home. leave beer for minors to just come and get if you're not in your house. You cannot do that. But they created an attractive nuisance with this with these little lights. I'm on camera, I know. Let me go pl plug back in the lights. Just a minute.
this is not okay, it's not safe. They are inviting really bad behavior to their home. Don't you think? I mean, they're not even here, and they're using electricity. They probably say they're using electricity because they're not here. Well, if they didn't leave a whole bunch of beer on their porch, they might not have to worry about it. buy this expensive little thing to put here and waste electricity here, which is bull I'm not okay with that at all, then why would you be okay with all your friends coming down and partying next to a freaking crack house? They've done nothing. They spend way more energy having a party at the door. Oh, wow, that's awesome. Because Charlie wrote stuff on it. Oh, and they put these little, little wood things here, like they're all super, so super cool. Moving forward, this Karen says she could do whatever she wants. <laughs> Darling, you can't. I can, take I can do whatever I want to do. I can. Right, can I have a master's in communication. Tomorrow. All the then movies you're you watching, all the movies you're watching, I do the PR for it, Jessica. Okay. So you probably want to calm down and pipe down and go take you some meth because you look like a meth head. That's why you mad because you can't get off of work and smoke your drugs. Excuse me, children. I can record whatever I want. I got a master's. I know the law. You a you probably don't even know how to spell Google backwards with your teeth crossed. Who are you talking to? So disrespectful. So, I'm going to send this to the president of American Airlines and all the board of directors. Jessica, since this lady in a spinal fusion ain't going to get no help, Jessica, call the police, Jessica, so they can arrest a black woman over recording, Jessica, with your white privilege. Jessica, your fat. Now call the police. I'm about to call the police, actually. Karen says she's not a person like this, but she's so mad that she turns into a Karen. Such a lame excuse. <laughs> Karen is calling the other person Karen while saying, you're the problem of the world. Yeah, you are. You, you're being selfish and being a Karen. I'm sitting here after yeah, an appointment. Yeah, sitting being a Karen. N no, ma'am. That is on a Karen. Pardon me? That Pardon me. I can see. The this is not an appropriate way. You just way. Be kind. That's it. The world. You are the problem of the world. I am not the problem. Oh I'm sitting in my car. Sitting in your car, taking a spot that I, you don't need anymore. Ma'am, I have been in my car for like not even five minutes. Exactly. Not you even five leave. minutes. And why do you need to be in a spot that you're done with? 
I'm clearly not done. You are clearly done. I, I'm. You, are, you don't thanks. know what's going on in my life right now, and you don't know. And I have an appointment okay. in this building. I also have an appointment in this building. And you're done because you're not in the building anymore. Ma'am, it is a parking spot that you are losing your mind over right now, and I would appreciate if you would just go and find another parking spot. That's, all, that's as simple as it is. As simple as it is, is that this is what happens in the world. People go, and then they send their car, and they're on their little phone because that is no, the world. No, because you cannot because you use your phone. No. Yeah. Lose the f***ing job. Karen locks her neighbor in to refrain her from using the horse trail. Take a look. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good one. Have fun. Thank you. Oh, tell community improvement because I got a lot of shit to say to them. <laughs> Joy, we're going to build a wall. And you're going to go from occasional usage to not. At least I'm not showing my f on camera, right? Enjoy. Oh, God, you're on camera too. So many times. Have fun. We have this Kevin. He tells a woman that she's an animal and then he'll break her jaw. Hold on, dude. I'm going to get my child. You need to get out of my face. I will break your jaw and. Get the camera out. Get the camera out. out. It's recording. Listen, Thank you. Great. You're recorded. That's great. And this is going to be aired. And so we'll see if you have a job tomorrow. That's great. Stay we'll see if you child. have a job tomorrow. Yes, Nobody I will have a job. Child. We'll see. This is going to get aired. That's great. You do not come in a woman's face and threaten to break her jaw. You do yeah. not threaten to break my jaw. Listen, uh, you do not threaten her. to break my jaw. Get out of her face. Do you understand? Because I have my mace. And they can go really, call really police. bad. Call the Let's call the police, police. right now because you threatened me on camera. Yes. Yes, you did. Call the police. If my child gets hurt. Let's call the police. I am not going to go directly. Let's call the police. What are you, what are you doing? Call them right what now because you you're not going to threaten me. Let's go. Come um, on. Call me. Call my love. Call me. You are not going to threaten me. How dare you? You don't come in my face either. Who do you think you are? Who do you think you I are? Call Ruth. Call for the our attorney. My attorney is on the way. Is he joking? He came in my face. Is he joking? What happened? Call Vila. Talk to you later. Don't cry, Naya. He, he's over here. Oh, he has a nerve. He's coming in my face. Don't cry. 
Watches abusive arguments. But we all I understand. So you saw what happened. I came here. I said everything okay. He said we'll see. He, told us he, he came, came in my face, face. Just came in her and face. I told him I need six feet. And that's when he said he doesn't have to give me six feet, and he will break my jaw. Yeah. Okay. I. That I'm not. I'm just saying he didn't. But say but but back. did but but did you see Listen, that? This part? all would have been he came solved in my face. if you just would have respected when I said, please watch your child from knocking no, over. No, I said give me six feet. You came in my face. Because I no, said, not because you don't listen, go in a woman's you're face. You're and so are you. No, 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 no. So are listen, you. You, you never listen, go in a woman's face. All I face. care about is the kids. I don't care about what it. you say. You do we not come in my face. It's yeah. not even my You kid. do not come in right. my face. I, mean, I don't know how many guys came in your face, okay? No, no, no. What? You can't call her trash, though. You that's came not, in my that's face. Not what that's not what you're going to do, sir. You're not going to have that. Okay. And you have your own kids. Like, you can't call people trash. In front of your kids. And you call me classless? Look at you. And if you're gonna call you want me to go to you when when your kid I would never go into someone's nephew. face. I stopped him before something happened. I understand. So all, okay. was, all I said was, Ma'am, I am not talking problem. to you anymore. I'm talking to him. I don't care. I can do what I, I want know to you do. Don't. Because you don't have any class. And neither do you in front of your daughter talking to another woman like that. You can't say you're not a woman, okay? I'm not a man. You are not a man. What? You are not a man. Okay. It's all recorded. It's all recorded. But listen, look look how you're talking to her. You're telling her she's not a woman. She might be a transvestite. But then you're trying to have a serious conversation. He's a joke. No, that's my cousin. He's a joke. Where's Bruce? I don't care. But you're not going to talk to my cousin like that. Then they're going to have a conversation with me. I'm just trying to prove my point. I only care you about can't the kids' prove, safety. You're not proving you, a point. Okay, let's go. If you cared about yeah. the kids' safety, you wouldn't even talk like yeah, that. Right here. You wouldn't even talk like that. That's, that's exactly, and, and now you see exactly how he came yeah, to me. Like that's, he came and stepped in it. my oh, face. It's no, it's not working. And if you're going to call the cops, at least stick around here. for your police. Here. 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 Oh, All right, we'll have the cover. You're on camera, so you that's have to fine. I don't care. I don't care about the kids' safety. We do. Let's go. Let's go. We'll see if you have an apology on ABC News tomorrow. I don't care. You're we'll not going to do anything to me. We you can't see. touch me. I work for myself. We will see. We and yeah, and zero reviews on Google. We, we will see. That's great. Come on. Put your shoes on. Come on, guys. Put your shoes on. Please put your shoes on, Chris. Keep, keep recording him. Chris, put your shoes on. Watch this Karen losing her mind in this argument. Goddamn president. You are the racist. 
racist. You are the racist. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, I'm not. I'm sorry. Because you guys ruined my business. If you guys want to do it, do it outside. Karen is cursing at an 11 year old because she heard him curse. That's where I work, sweetheart. You're going to get yourself into trouble. Don't call me, Karen. Don't call me names. You're cussing around children at an elementary school. Hell isn't a cuss word. I can record too. You're not gonna have a pleasant life. You're very, very disrespectful. And you're lucky I'm not getting out of my car and smashing your phone. You probably don't even deserve to have a phone. You're not you're not responsible enough, that's for sure. Yeah, you know that was a threat, right? What, to break your phone? Yeah, it's a threat. Another Karen at a restaurant. Look how she's instructing the employees. Wow. 